Yo, what is up, my beautiful, good-looking, handsome viewers? Today, I want to do a Kali Yuga Master Deck profile. But before we start, I want to do a giveaway because I got some packages from Thief Chief. First of all, here I got the beautiful Dragon Ball deck box over here. And I also got here the Chaos uh, deck box. Those are elites, bro. Like, all of those deck boxes, bro. This is high quality, man. If you're looking still for a beautiful deck box, make sure to check out uh, SleeveChief.de. Uh, and don't forget to use a code Kenek5. Okay, look at this beautiful deck box, man. Look at this. Look at this. I've got beautiful artworks and good high quality stuff. Plus, this is magnet. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Okay. Uh, the one I'm giving away, however, is the prosperity box. This is actually also finest quality, man. Like, just so much. It's so, so good just touching it, okay? <laughs> I got two of us. That's why I'm giving away one of that. And I'm still using the, this one here. Look at this. This is the one I uh, made top 16 at the regional. And I really like it, man. You can double sleeve your cards. I'm right now. I'm changing my sleeves every once in a while. But uh, yeah, you can easily double sleeve. Right now, there are like 40 main deck cards, 15 extra deck, and 15 side deck. But you can easily play like 60 cards or double sleeve them. However, and then, yeah, you got your dices. Full magnetic, 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 magnet, magnetic, yeah, whatever. Okay, um, all you gotta do for this giveaway is to comment under this video and also follow me on Instagram, okay? So that once you win it, I can message you on Instagram and change information so that I can send it to you. But all, that's all you gotta do. Comment on this video, follow me on Instagram, and yeah, okay? So, <laughs> It is time for the Kali Yuga build. Okay, let's check out what I have. So I did reach master rank five. Um, master rank, master rank one. No, no, no. The master rank. Fuck. I, I reached master rank with this build. Okay. Um, I didn't do it on stream because I didn't have the time to stream it yet. But I did, did want to make this video. However, in the next stream, I will continue playing with this deck. It's easy to to reach master rank one with this. Okay, I don't think it's an issue. We're gonna do it live on stream and yeah let's check out what i have so um basically i'm playing one valor and one droll because they are um not only good hand chests but they're also great ex um small world bridges for us okay because once in a while when you get like max seed and you don't have ash on your hand or call by or cross out on your hand what you can do is use a small world to bridge one of your black wings uh, into like an assault synchron or into maxi no not maxi sorry for example you can bridge one gale into assault synchron and then get the draw lock bar to your hand or one of your zudris into assault synchron get draw lock bar to your hand or valor into assault synchron into draw lock bar or even uh yeah not ash but yeah there are a lot of ways, okay? Just in general, uh, in general, thanks to all those hand traps and assault synchron, you really have crazy small world lines. And yeah, that's one thing. And then, but I'm only playing two of those because we don't have that much space in the X deck. But yeah, and obviously free maxis. You gotta play it. If you're not playing maxi master, then I don't know what you're doing. And then we got the free ashes, which is also common sense because not only are they great hand traps, but they also are good for going first. To stop cards like maxi and then um yeah call buys and cross out are basically just there together with imperm as a cross out target um i mean they're not only good for going first but they're also sometimes good for going second so that's why we're playing the only reason why i'm playing two black Wormans and one black feather Wormans is we don't need we do not need more to be honest we do not need more and small world and the prosperity has give us the enough consistency so that we do not break that much okay that you're going to break once in a while okay but every break uh, every deck breaks okay so don't even come at me with oh this deck breaks every deck is going to break once once in a while okay i don't i've never played or seen a deck that has never ever break even snake eyes or every other deck breaks once in a while that shit happens okay and especially especially like in a format where max c is like a thing you have to play certain cards like Maxi, Ash, Call by Crossout. Just to be able to play the game. 
and those cards can obviously also break but you have to play them because it's the game right so yeah one steam and one gale um i'm playing still gale because honestly ever since we got shanga we don't really have to play gale but it's still a great extender plus it gives us access to another two card combo which is like gale and Dudri that can also summon the kali yuga and yeah basically those are the reasons the only breaks that you're playing in this deck basically are raider's wing and the rank up and me personally i'm not a fan of playing any bricks in any deck which is why i don't see this being the best black wing deck however in some matches and some duels and like some scenarios this deck is superior because if you're playing against Mikanko, if you're playing against labyrinth or against like any like there are some decks where are or like stun decks or like really ugly decks where you, where you just need a card like Kali Yuga sometimes you feel me sometimes you just need it and that's why i believe um this deck is still competitive and master but um the, like you you will reach master rank one it's okay no doubt but it's gonna take a while that's all i want to say uh well you're def definitely going to be able to reach it all right and then um we got nofung we got Burial storm obsidian joe raikiri black wing dragon one ball savage dragon one draco berserker one armor monster double soul dragon one this pad i really love playing with this pad so especially like going second i really really love this card so not gonna miss out on the, that one and we got the azure falcon the ddd the best black wing ever <laughs> crazy how black wings can easily summon this card and raiders uh, i mean raid raptor can nowadays also summon that card or even they did back in the day obviously but i feel like no other deck summons this card better than we do because once the moon you can play through two infinite impermanences and still summon kaliuga that is crazy right and then um yeah but these y tricks obviously we have to play and yeah all right <laughs> here are some highlights some footages some matchups uh, that i had with this deck so yeah stay tuned watch it and enjoy it and yeah, if you got any questions feel free to ask in the comment section below all right <laughs> enjoy
Thank you.